happy Saturday and welcome to a new vlog. Ooh -ooh. So today I am going to have an admin day. This past week was kind of crazy in the best way possible. But yeah, I was kind of all over the place this week and I figured I would take you throughout my day. I already had breakfast and I had breakfast in bed. So I'm having, I mean, I already finished it, but I had one of my favorite burritos, like frozen burritos. It's by a brand called Sweet Earth and it's the Peruvian and it has seitan, quinoa, sweet potato, uh, black beans, goat cheese, corn, spirulina, and it's rich and earthy. This is what it looks like. You can get it at Whole Foods. I'm sure you can get it at King Supers um, and other places. And I also put the Trader Joe's Magna Sauce on it. Magnificent Sauce. Magnificent Sauce on it. Yeah. A tangy sauce of secret proportions. It's really good. I mean, I like it. And now I'm having this like citrus tea from Heb. Ooh. It's at the perfect temperature because your girl's got a cat's tongue. And I'm about to take my vitamin in a few minutes because I try to take it at the same time every day. But it's currently, I'm gonna look at the time, 8.26. And I have my little reminder to tell me when to take my vitamins. I have this star on my face because I have like this pimple and it has this is by a brand called Starface and this the blue ones have salicylic acid in it so it like helps to unclog your pores and all that stuff and it has been doing a good job at first I was skeptical because I was using my hero cosmetics and I think they're great and then I was just like I couldn't find them when I went to Target so I tried Starface and I like the fact they have salicylic acid in there because it's really good for when you have a pimple and stuff. And I'm like, I want to get all the stuff out. And it has done wonders. Like I had one up here, no scar. My nails look so bad. I'm not going to show you guys up close because that would be horrible. But I'm getting my nails done for the first time uh, next week. For the first time in a long time. But this procedure I've never had done. It's a it's hard gel. So I'm excited to get that done. But yeah, I'm gonna get ready in a little bit. I'm just watching a new video by Este on YouTube. And I'm gonna go to a coffee shop and do some admin um as well as edit some videos and stuff like that because I have to reply to some emails. I also need to edit some photos, um, plan content, all that fun stuff, and also see if I can get like my hair redone. I'm thinking of doing crochet braids because my grandma said she would help me when I'm in Texas, but I'm kind of at the point where I'm like, should I just get my hair done? Like, should I just get it braided? But I know my like I want to give myself a break and not have to worry about it um so I think sometime in December I'll get my hair braided so I guess I made my decision of what's going on with my hair but yeah I'm gonna get ready shortly put a look together I need to see first the weather does anyone else do that confuse the maps and the weather app on their phone I do that all the time, but it's going to be semi-warm today. It's going to be in the 60s, low 60s, but it's a little bit warm. So I can wear like sweatpants, a t-shirt, and a trench, but I don't think I want to take my trench. I got this new jacket for my friend, my best friends, and it's really cute and soft. It makes me look like a teddy bear, so I'm probably going to wear that with some sweats and a white tee and my new balances. Also, I'm gonna show you guys, I'm planning, so I like sneakers, in case you guys 
to that now. Oh, I gotta take my vitamin. So I have to take it with my tea. Check that reminder off. Wait, this drops today? Oh. It's sold out. Wait, it's not sold out? But I don't really want to pay $200 for these sneakers. They look fresh. Don't these sneakers look fresh? They look amazing. But I'm thinking of getting these high dunks. Like, I don't know. So I'll get ready here in a bit. I'm just gonna probably finish watching this video. I have laundry that I should put away. My room is a mess. My room is an absolute mess. Yeah, so I guess the first thing we'll be doing is putting away my laundry, cleaning my room, getting ready, and then we'll start our day in the outside world. And I'll take you guys along for this day in the life with Jazz. I plan on at least getting two videos edited and uploaded because the past couple weeks were kind of chaos in preparation for everything that happened this past week. Um, so yeah, and then also just like meeting with friends and stuff like that, like my life was just going a thousand miles a minute, so I didn't have time to like edit videos. And when I did, I was exhausted, so exhausted. But I mean, I do everything myself, so I have to make time because I like YouTube and I like uploading videos. Anyways, I've talked too long. We'll talk soon. So I am ready and I kind of realize I'm wearing a pretty sustainable outfit today. Just gotta widen, widen up the, the pants, but 
the sweats, as you can see, they are from H&M Sustainable line. I'm wearing my Sacconis and I'm wearing my Uniqlo socks. I also have an Everlane shirt on that says 100% human. I've had this for years. And this was the little teddy bear uh, jacket that I was talking to you guys about um, that I got as a gift this past week. So yeah, I would say it's pretty sustainable. Like Everlane is a pretty sustainable brand. H&M has a sustainable line and they're trying to be as sustainable as possible. Shoes for me are always pretty sustainable because I have them for years. <laughs> um, I usually try to get good quality sneakers at least. And so, yeah, I mean, sustainability also means just like making sure things last really well. So yeah, I have these. They should probably go in for a little bit of a wash, but that is okay. And Uniqlo is a pretty sustainable brand as well. And yeah, this was a gift. Um, not sure if it is a sustainable brand or not, but I'm gonna wear it as much as possible and try to make it sustainable. And if not, um, if I don't keep clothes, I usually try to donate them to make it into a sustainable practice. So yeah, my bags are packed, got my purse, which is also from an ethical and sustainable brand from Causebox. Been loving it. Have my Bose headphones, my laptop, my charger, my hard driver in there. As you can see, my bed is clean, table, I mean, there's like some papers, but generally it's, you know, the room is clean. <laughs> um, there's the kid and some, you know, boxes that I need to do a video on. But yeah, essentially, I'm ready. So I just realized that today I'm supposed to start my period. So that's one thing. And I also realized that the book that I was supposed to pick up from the library is one that I've already read. I'm currently reading through a series called Red Rising. And I've already finished the trilogy. I'm just reading the two books that are past it. Um, and, oops. I also realized that this morning I should have gotten up really early to go get my tires rotated because I'm taking a road trip for the holidays soon. But yeah, I'm taking a road trip for the holidays and so I need my tires rotated before I drive home for the holidays and yeah. So I gotta do that and I also am due for an oil change in like the next hundred miles, but I figure I will just get that done beforehand because there's no use in waiting till I get to my destination because then I'm gonna be past those hundred miles. So a lot of the things that I thought I was gonna do today uh, in terms of the errands that I was gonna run are not happening, but I'm still gonna try to go to a coffee shop now and pick up what I need, not pick up what I need, do some admin stuff. So I'm gonna try to schedule appointments for my car and then also edit a few videos as well. And then I am going to get myself some Korean noodles. I don't wanna say the name wrong. I think it's called chapche. Um, it's like black bean noodles. It looks quite tasty. I am excited to try have that. Um, haven't had it in a bit. So yeah, also it's very windy today. It's been windy this past week. Let me just be real. I was in the mountains earlier this week and it was, I was staying in, a, in an Airbnb and the house was built in like 1914. I was staying in an Airbnb and the house was built in like 1914 and it was so windy that like I woke up every hour on the hour because of how much I could just hear the wind. It was so intense. So yeah, I'm gonna get myself to this coffee shop and start doing some admin stuff and I'll see y'all there. Hopefully I don't get uh, camera shy because because y'all know that like it's, 
a little intimidating to vlog in public so I'm gonna try to see if I can find a seat where it's not as exposed <laughs> I got myself a medium fry and then I started thinking girl you're really hungry like you need to eat and you already had caffeine yesterday so you don't need to have caffeine today and honestly it's not like you really need to go to a coffee shop to pay for something that is gonna make you too hype when you don't have a ton in your stomach right now and you're starving so I'm not going to the coffee shop <laughs> all that to say I'm going to pick up my black bean Korean noodles take myself home and I'm gonna schedule the appointments at home because honestly, I don't wanna go. Also the coffee shop that I was gonna go to looked a little packed. And it's like, I don't wanna drive to find another one. I like how they do their chais, you know? And then I sort of started thinking about the noodles that I was going to have. And I was like, that just sounds more important to me right now. <laughs> so, yeah. Going to finish my fries. And then I'm going to have this food. Honestly, today doesn't even feel like a Saturday. It feels like a bizarre day. I don't know how to explain that, but... How to say choppagetti? Korean choppagetti is choppagetti. My order is ready. Perfect. I'll probably come in tomorrow. All right. Sounds good. Thank you. Bye. Hello. My, my room looks so, like, chic in this angle. I promise it's not that chic. It's pretty empty. But I scheduled my appointment for my tie rotation. I usually take my car to Grease Monkey for my oil changes. So, also, I'm currently having some ice cream. It's really good flavor. I wanted like a light 
flavor. I feel like chocolate sometimes can be really heavy. And this is what it looks like. But yeah, I didn't have a uh, chopped yet. It's just really good. Black bean noodles with egg, cream beef. Mm. This is the spot because it has like chocolate pieces in there, but it's salted caramel cluster with cashew milk. Mm. And yeah, finished having lunch. I'm actually pretty full, so I'm probably not going to have a ton of ice cream. But on my list today, I need to, I already like scheduled my appointment. I'm gonna go in tomorrow to get my oil changed. They're open till five today, but sometimes those waits can be like really long. I've also realized this is kind of like, hopefully that's straighter. So I think going in first thing in the morning is gonna be better. Grease Monkey opens at 10, so I'm probably gonna go to church tomorrow morning for the first service, head to Grease Monkey as soon as they open and get my car oil changed because I leave next weekend, essentially, to drive to Texas. I'm only staying for a week. I'm not gonna do what I did last year and stay for six weeks, <laughs> although that was very needed for my mental health last year. Last year was just, oof. Last year was, we don't gotta talk about it. It's, I mean, we'll talk about it, but we're not gonna talk about it right now. It was a lot. Anyways, I am gonna get on with editing. I don't really have too much planned. I just need to edit some videos. And plus, it looks like it's gonna storm outside, so. I guess it's a really good thing that I'm not at a coffee shop right now because it like although it looks really light right now it does but like on that side I can like see it coming this way it's very ominous outside so I don't like being caught up in storms when I go out so yeah have things scheduled and now I'm just gonna you know edit some videos so I'll check in with you guys soon probably show you a little bit of me editing here in a moment but yeah <laughs>
so I think I'm gonna just end the video here because I'm just gonna continue working for the rest of the night I've started Christmas shopping it's that time of year guys it's that time of year gotta do some Christmas shopping I've already done some the past couple weeks and so just picking out some gifts for some people that I think would like certain things obviously not revealing anything because I don't want people finding out what I'm getting for them on my vlog so I gotta keep it a secret but yeah I'm just gonna continue working away almost finished editing a couple videos I also finished a Korean drama The Lawless Lawyer on Netflix it was pretty good and I also finished that ice cream that pint of ice cream because I was watching it while eating and then before you knew it before I knew it the pint of ice cream was empty but my room is clean so that's good I clean my room put away my laundry and yeah I have a clean apartment which is nice and I'm getting organized I'm getting back into the swing of things which is just the best feeling ever because for the longest time life has been chaos been preparing for some events for some friends and then also meeting with people um, hanging out with people which has been great and then work has just been crazy too but it's the end of the year so things are kind of slowing down just like a tinge probably only for this up oops <laughs> probably only for this upcoming week things are gonna be slow and then after that it's gonna be chaos town you know with the holidays and stuff you would think that things would slow down but no no things things pick up because people are trying to get things done at the last minute and I am part of the you know the puzzle and getting those things done for people who are trying to get them done last minute so next week is gonna be kind of crazy but yeah, Saturday has been kind of chill, a lot chiller than I expected. I was able to get an earlier Costco appointment for my tire rotation. So basically, I'm going to go into town, go home for the holidays, and I'm going to get it done there instead of waiting until after I'm back because these tires need rotating. They need rotating. But I can still get my oil changed tomorrow. So I'm gonna do that. Probably gonna work out early in the morning, go to church, and then head to Grease Monkey, get my oil changed, and then my tires will be inflated and all that stuff. And yeah. Also, that Chop Getty is the best. It's so bomb. It's so delicious like it's like sweet yet savory it's perfect it's like my new favorite thing I just discovered it recently and was like I need to explore more of this menu I also just need to explore more restaurants in general but anyways if you've made it to the end of this video Thank you so much for watching and listening to me ramble and seeing the random things that I did get up to today, which wasn't a lot, but you know, I would say getting my room organized was a lot because it was piles of laundry for a long time and the floor is clear. The vibes are good. I just need to put on a candle to really set the mood. Probably gonna do a face mask. My skin is looking pretty clear, I will say. But yeah, thanks for making it to the end of this video and for watching. And if you haven't already, please do give this video a thumbs up. If you liked any part of this video, subscribe so you can keep up to date with me and all the things that I'm doing. And comment down below, say hi, I say hi back. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.